Malarkey Television presents its third installment of Wolf in Sheep's Clothing. Today we bring your attention to the cupcake. Yes, I said cupcake. Cupcakes come in many different flavors, colors, and decor to make it appealing to the eye and taste buds. Upon the first taste of the chocolate, vanilla, frosting covered, smothered in rainbow sprinkles cupcake, there is no going back. This is Bruno. Notice the way Bruno's face lights up as he spots the cupcake. He wants that cupcake. Bruno eats the cupcake and proceeds to run out the door, on to play on both playgrounds at opposite ends of the neighborhood, spinning around aimlessly or giggling uncontrollably and singing songs of rainbows, puppies, and unicorns dipped in cupcake frosting. After this chaotic whirlwind is completed, Bruno doesn't feel very well. He starts to head home, but is very sluggish and barely making it to the loo, proceeds to vomit and then pass out. But what does this mean? Let me make a comparison for you. This is a baggie of crystal meth. This is Maggie. This is Maggie's face after observing the baggie of crystal meth. Even though she's playing it cool, this is the face she's making on the inside. Maggie proceeds to partake in the crystal meth in the manner of her choosing. Now, what behaviors in Maggie's will we find familiar to Bruno's behavior? After, she proceeds to run around the house, out the door, on to play in the backyard of every neighbor around for miles, spinning around aimlessly while giggling uncontrollably and singing songs of incomprehensible subject matter. After many days, this chaotic whirlwind is completed. Maggie doesn't feel very good. She hurries home, but is very sluggish, and barely making it to the loo, proceeds to vomit, and then pass out. Now, I assume we are all intelligent to have noticed the similarities. Cocaine, heroin, marijuana, acid, ecstasy, crystal meth, and cupcakes. You heard correct. Cupcakes are a drug. Drug, a substance that has a psychological effect when ingested or otherwise introduced into the body in particular. Somehow, cupcakes have managed to fly below the radar of harmful illegal substances and instead are sold in every grocery store, bakery, and gas station you'll ever walk into. Now you can be aware of the hidden danger and seek help if you've been exposed to its sugary rainbow wonders. This has been another installment of Wolf in Sheep's Clothing here on Malarkey Television. Stay tuned for next week's edition in which we discuss the danger of children.